In today's video, we can't turn left. If we turn left at any of Monty Mole's signs, the video will end instantly. We already did the can't turn right challenge, but this one is a lot harder than I thought. We had some crazy moments during this match, so make sure you watch till the end to see how we did. This one's gonna be tough. This one's gonna be tough. We did the can't turn right. Now we're doing the can't turn left. I was hoping to get a low roll so I could buy a custom dice next turn, but we're not gonna be able to afford it. So what are we gonna get? I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, what block? It means we can't get the star next turn, but we got to think long term and what block could really save us. Hopefully, I'm hoping that that is the right choice. Now we're super lucky because we rolled a 10, which means we land on the event space, which is going to make the sign go left, which means next turn it'll be right and we should be safe. Crazy Daisy is here, ladies and gentlemen. What crazy thing is she going to do today? And we have Luigi, a fan favorite, as well as a T-Law favorite. And lastly, we have Wario, who is no one's favorite. Everyone getting terrible rolls on turn one. Except for us, obviously. But he gets a double dice, so it's not all that bad. All right, everyone against Wario for the first mini game. We're playing hide and sneak. Not really that much sneaking, though. It's basically just hiding. You can actually be as loud as you want. As usual, we went house. Uh, hopefully, 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 hopefully. Well, I think we lost. You can do it, Luigi. Come on, it's all up to you. Make me proud. Make your fans proud. We believe in you, Luigi. Come on. I really want those coins. Okay, rock. What's Luigi picked? Oh! We lost. Okay, bad start, but at least the video hasn't ended yet. I'm trying to figure out what to do here. The star is right there. We can't buy the star, so it doesn't matter. There is a sign six spaces ahead of us that is pointing left. That means if we roll a five or more, the video will end. So do we warp with Luigi, Daisy or Wario? But then we're still in danger because the sign will be facing left next turn. We don't have any coins to buy a custom dice. This is, this is looking grim. I think we just have to risk it to be honest. Gonna have to leave it up to chance, save the warp block. Oh my gosh, that is so good. And we didn't even pass the star. If we get coins at the lucky space, we could maybe get the star next turn. Wow, the dream lives on. That was pretty damn lucky. Ooh, chomp call though. Didn't want that. Uh, so I just realized we're actually stuck in this bottom corner of the map. We're gonna have to do something about that. I don't want to be going around in a circle this whole match. If one of our friends goes left, then we could try and use the warp block to swap places with them, and that would give us access to the rest of the map. That's probably gonna be our best bet. We're gonna have to do it strategically though, because we don't want to warp into a left-facing arrow sign. Wario could get the star here, he needs a 13, he's got the double dice, two big rolls, okay, kind of halfway, oh no, he fell short. To be honest though, he'll probably get it next turn, because unless we get a coin minigame, we can't afford the star, so actually, I might just end up using the chomp call. Although, if we get a really low roll next turn, the video is over. Alright, this time it's everyone against Daisy, and I want to win this minigame, because we didn't win the first one, I need some coins. Come here, Daisy, I'm just kind of playing defense. Wario and Luigi are kind of playing the offense. Oh, this could be it. Okay, she escaped. Now we're on the chase. Oh, oh, Luigi. Yes. No, I should have gone down. Wario, you can help anytime you want. Anytime. Never mind, I'll do it. Well, this is a sad moment right next to Toadette and we're using a chomp call. I don't think I've ever had to do that before. Okay, well, we can't get that star because it's right next to the left turn. I'm wondering if that warp block was a bad purchase. We could have had a star if we didn't buy that. I was kind of trying to play it safe though, because that warp block came in super clutch last challenge. Now, you know, I think I think we made the right choice. I think the warp block was a good buy. We still got plenty of time to buy stars. It's only turn three, so I'm not worried. We just need to get out of this little loop that we're stuck in. That's our biggest obstacle right now. Ooh, Daisy gets a lucky space. She probably hoping for some coins here. She's pretty low on coins, and that'll definitely help. Luigi right next to the star, but he's only got 16 coins. Losing that first minigame really affected a lot of this match. But I guess that's Mario Party, right? One little thing can change the whole game. At least Wario is not going to get a star though, I'm happy about that. Getting that chomp call on the lucky space was actually pretty good. Alright, third minigame and we finally get a free-for-all minigame. I'm happy about that. The 1 vs 3 minigames, I mean they're good minigames, but I don't really like them because I don't like everyone winning coins. Unless I'm the one, that's okay. If it's me against everyone else, that's all right because I like denying everyone of getting coins. It's a good feeling. Helps me sleep at night. Well, this mini game is a bit of a no contest. Looks like we're going all the way on our own. Everyone else doing pretty bad, but that's all right. That means more coins for me. 
Okay, well the good news is, is we don't have to worry about turning left for a while. Toadette actually proving harder to get than I thought. I thought someone was going to get that star straight away. Oh, Daisy going up there. That's good. I might try and warp with her. Luigi, if he goes left, that would also be good. Then we'd have two options to warp. Otherwise, it's kind of risky, but sometimes you just got to take those risks. Like I said, I don't want to be trapped in this corner the whole match. We do not need another what if you were stuck at the start challenge. Wario using his double dice. Okay, he hasn't really got anywhere to go, but I guess he just wants to get out of here. Understandable, I kind of feel the same way. 14 is not a bad roll. I wouldn't mind one of those myself. Although, being back here, I do feel kind of safe because we don't have to worry about going past any signs. Why did he go up there? He would have been super close to the star next turn, but I guess he just wanted an item. All right, Dinger Derby. This is one of my strongest mini games. Spent a lot of time playing this mini game, getting a perfect score. I'm not going to say how much time though, because it was a lot. You can see though, all that hard work paid off. We are 9 for 9, 10 for 10, 11 for 11, 12 for 12. I'm going to stop doing that now. I always do good in the beginning and then I panic. So many times I got to like 27, 28 and then I'd miss one of the last shots. Okay, 10 to go now. Oh, there it is. I knew it was coming. I've just, the pressure always gets to me. I've missed two now. Once I miss one, I just start missing all of them. There we go. That's three misses. But it's all right. We still got 26. Yeah, 26. You know what? YOLO. Do people still say that? I'm saying it. No risk, no reward. Just don't give me Luigi or it's over, basically. Yes! Daisy, that's exactly what we wanted. Okay, probably a bad play, but it paid off. If we waited till next turn, it probably would have been a little bit safer, but I just wanted to get to this item shop because next turn it will be selling golden pipes and that means a star. Have fun over there, Daisy. It's super lame. Man, I had no business doing that play. That was such a risky play, but I did it all for the content. Did it for you guys. Oh, wow. That could have been us. Luckily for Daisy, she doesn't have a lot to lose. She's only got 13 coins and no stars. Well, no one has any stars. Imagine if she got a shuffle. That would actually be pretty funny. Oh, half your coins. Actually not that bad, but still satisfying. Luigi still can't afford the star. I don't know why he bought that chomp call last turn. That was a bad play. At least he'll be able to buy it after this turn. Oh, holy moly. It's a hidden block. Please be coins. Okay, that's fine. I don't mind that. Wario has used a lot of movement items this match. Definitely going for the Sightseer bonus. And the item bonus, I guess. Still not going to get a star, though. Alright, another 3 vs 1 minigame. This time everyone against Daisy. Crazy old Daisy. Don't give a crazy person controls of whatever this is. That's just a recipe for disaster. Thanks, Wario and Luigi, for all your help. Again worst teammates ever actually i can't say that about luigi that's not fair wario though he sucks he didn't help in squared away either all right we made it halfway somehow i feel like we've dodged a few bullets we're in first place but it's kind of meaningless we're only winning on coins we have a few more coins than wario and luigi daisy definitely losing but it's still anyone's match even daisy the next five turns gonna be super important item shop here i come hopefully is that enough i'm not sure okay we made it give me a golden pipe this is a strategy i used in the can't turn left what are we doing we can't turn we can't turn left this is a strategy i used in the can't turn right challenge where it kind of works as a warp block as well daisy basically starting the match over she's back at the start with only six coins oh now 12. luigi's up to something he's using his triple dice i don't know where he's going he couldn't be any further away from the star I guess he's just going to do another lap and maybe try and pick up the star next turn. But he rolled too much. He's actually going to end up going right. Oh, he's doing the hidden block play. One of his most famous plays. It's worked for him in the past. Luigi is all about the content. He's an absolute showman. And that's why we love him so much. I love how close everyone keeps getting to the star. But then the sign keeps pointing the wrong way. Oh, snap. Wario got a golden pipe. Luckily, we have a golden pipe as well, but it's going to make things pretty close. Bombs away, baby. Finally, another free-for-all minigame. Daisy will be happy about that. She's been getting pretty hammered in the 1 vs 3 minigames. I'm just constantly bonking on her head. Oh, that was so close. That was almost everyone off in one thing. All right, just Daisy left. What was that? I just like flew across the whole map. One of the biggest jumps I've ever seen in my life. Okay, we're not piping yet. We're going to save it for a couple more turns. It's coming though, it's coming. You just gotta plan it because we've got the sign to think about. Gotta take all those things into consideration. We got a video that we gotta save. You know, we don't want the video to end. So just gonna take it nice and slow. 
It's gonna be fine, just trust me. Crazy Daisy is kind of plain Daisy today. She's lost all her spiciness. Okay, she rolls a nine, but she can't get to the... What is she doing? Maybe she really is crazy. She's just lost her mind. She's got no idea what's going on. Oh, this is it. This is it. I thought he might save it for the last turn. This could be huge. The Luigi content play. Oh, that hurts. Five coins? That's so bad. He basically just threw away 35 coins. He deserved better than that. Luigi, we still love you though. Green hearts in the comments for Luigi. Oh damn, Wario using his golden pipe. I actually wanted to use that star. It was in a good location. So I guess we'll just have to see where the next one ends up. Could actually be a little bit of a problem. Oh, so lucky Wario only has 11 coins. Okay, that means we just have to wait until that sign up there is facing right and then it's piping time. Okay, that's good. I think the Bowser space scared Wario off. Otherwise, he might have got that star next turn. Oh yeah, I feel like Wario probably should have risked it with the Bowser space. He definitely would have had enough coins. But, you know, sometimes you just got to play it safe. You never know what the best play is until after it's happened. Okay, can I get some coins, please? This is, this is tragic. Oh, give me that money bag. Give me it! How did I miss that? Luckily, Wario got it. I'm not getting anything. I'm really letting down the team. Oh my god. I, I'm like repelling coins. This is so sad. What a terrible team player. Well, I think I got one coin, right? Maybe? Alright, so the sign next to Toadette is facing left, so we do not want to use the golden pipe this turn. Ooh, is Daisy warping? Crazy Daisy's back. What's she gonna do? Oh, it's Luigi. I saw him in the back. She's literally like back at the space she was at five turns ago. What a terrible match. Oh, a 10 though. So she's basically just going to end up where she was before she warped. Like almost the worst play I've ever seen. She is. She's on the exact same space. That was actually the worst warp block I've ever seen. At least she gets the dual Luigi. She's going all in. But I'd be very surprised if she wins. Today is not her day. Maybe she'll surprise us though. Who knows? Whoever loses this basically is just out of the match. Okay. Luigi wins. I thought so. Daisy, there's no coming back. Oh, Luigi just needs 16 now to get to the star. Maybe this was his plan all along. Okay, five. Oh, no. Needs a 10. Oh, so close. One short. That has to hurt. Oh, my gosh. And we're going to swoop in next turn and take it with the golden pipe. Poor Luigi. But at the same time, I'm also kind of happy about that. Oh no, and he takes the hit with the Bowser space. This turn could have gone so much better for him. Let's wait and see what he gets first. He might be alright. He doesn't have any stars to lose, so that's a plus. Alright, 10 coins, actually not that bad. Probably the best he could have got. And he might end up getting the Bowser bonus star. So Wario remains our biggest threat. The only other person with a star. Well, actually the only person with a star. We don't even have a star yet. There has not been a lot of stars bought this match. Everyone's gotten pretty unlucky with Monty Mole. All right, back to the three versus one mini games. This time we're against Luigi. If anyone's gonna win a three versus one, it's Luigi. Other than myself, of course. And he's really gonna win if I keep missing all these shots. Come on, what am I doing? Oh, uh, that one just went straight to him. Okay, this is bad. We're, we're not where we wanna be. Still winnable though, if we make some good shots. Okay, this is just, what am I doing? Okay, there's one. Three more. Can we do it? If everyone scores. Oh, no. Oh, that was my fault. I take responsibility for that loss. I played so bad. All right, you know what time it is. It's piping time, baby. I'm really not sure how that's become my catchphrase. I'm sure I could do a lot better. All right, anyway, finally time to get a start on turn nine. We just need more than one. Okay, eight. That's a good roll. Imagine if we got a one and failed the challenge on the last turn. Wouldn't be the first time. Okay, don't think anyone's going to make it to that before the end of next turn, so that's fine. Going to make our final right turn of the match, I think. You never know, this is Mario Party, anything can happen. And we're going to finish up on the lucky space for this turn. Not the most exciting options, but uh, we are in first, so... Oh, hang on, okay. Chance time next turn, anyone? Daisy, running out of time, what are you going to do? Oh my gosh, she's going round again. What are you doing, Daisy? I think she's broken. Poor Luigi just missed out on that star. He has a triple dice though, so because he got that 10, he only needs 16 next turn to get the star. It could definitely happen. Oh boy, versus time. This could be very interesting. Everyone's coins are pretty close, except Daisy. She's just, she doesn't really count. All right, let's see what we're playing for here. Okay, 10 coins, that's not too bad. If we lose, it's not gonna be the end of the world. 
And the mini game is later skater. That's a bit of a freebie. I don't see us losing this. Okay, we've got one lap to go. It looks like we're in last, but we're actually about to overtake everyone. And there we go, an easy win. Believe it or not, Daisy actually came second, so she got a few coins out of that. Imagine if she won both the bonus stars or something and ended up winning the match. That would be the most undeserved first place ever. Oh no, I hate this mini game. I'm so bad at this. I have kind of a little bit figured out when to release for the back one, which is about now. Oh, did you see that? That was beautiful. First try. Okay, maybe this mini game isn't so bad after all. Let's see if we can get another chest. Another chest would be huge. Oh, here it comes. Oh, is Wario gonna snake it? Damn you! I'm pretty sure I would have got that too. But it's fine, it's fine. We'll get another one. Okay, here it comes, here it comes. Get ready. Now, okay, that's not not the row I was going for. Somehow I did a middle row. I don't even know how to do that, but it happened. At least we got a money bag though. Just give me one more chest and we'll be so good. Oh, that was so close! Just a tiny bit early. We got time for one more attempt. Okay, Luigi got that chest. We need one more chest, please. Uh, I don't know if I can risk waiting. I'm just gonna go for the money bag. Oh, okay, we got it. That's gonna give us 20 coins. We probably would have had time to wait for the chest, but that's all right. We still did pretty good. Oh, Daisy though, 31. Okay, this is probably a terrible idea, but I'm gonna go for the chance time. The content plays are not over yet, guys. A little tip for if you're in first place, especially if it's the last turn, don't choose to land on a chance time. It's a terrible idea, but we're gonna do it anyway. All right, give me a star, and then we just gotta get Wario here and we're fine. Oh, yes! I never get that right. Okay, if we just jump when we see Daisy's face, we might get me or Luigi. That's the opposite of what I said. Daisy doesn't deserve a star, she's done nothing this whole match. The joke about her winning might actually become a reality. I hope you're grateful, Daisy, because you did nothing to earn that star. That was meant to be my star. Oh, that's right, Luigi just needs 16 to get the star. Oh, he's going for it. He's used his triple dice. Okay, 10 more. Six more. Oh, no, he's fallen short again, and it's only just. That is the second time. So unlucky with the dice today. Poor old Luigi. And he just misses out on the bank as well. But he'll get a few coins from the lucky space. Not that it really matters. I mean, I don't think he's going to win without having a star. Oh, my gosh, I didn't even realize Wario was five away, and he got a five. Imagine if we hadn't done the chance time, he would have had two stars, that would have been so bad. That chance time was actually way better than I thought. Oh, hang on though, he's gonna land on the Bowser space, this could be good. Come on, lose one star. Make my day, Bowser, please. Oh, 20 coins, still pretty good. Alright, final minigame, everyone against Wario. We've had a lot of 1 vs 3 minigames today. That kind of happened in the last match we played as well. Okay, it's already over. All right, final announcements. It's pretty close. Luigi's probably out, but you never know. Minigame bonus. I'm fairly sure that's going to be us. Okay, that is good. That might actually seal the deal. I'm not 100% sure, but I think we just won. Second bonus is going to be the eventful bonus. I think that might be us too. We got one or two. All right. Two bonus stars, that's awesome. We have to share with Wario, but that's all right. And that means we are the can't turn left champions.